Delia right now. Adelia, you talk to some people who say those floodwaters <laughs> rose nearly three feet. Yeah, they say it was crazy. And as quickly as it came, they said it all disappeared. They, well, it's hard to have a clock ticking away when you're dealing with cars that are potentially flooded out. But they say it lasted 10 minutes. And I'm laughing, Leslie, because we literally just had a rainstorm of our own activity here. It's been downpouring since uh, 4 30 and our microphone short circuited we had to switch to another microphone we got you this live shot but take a look here at sligo creek parkway and 650 you can see traffic on 650 is starting to creep because we have a lot of water accumulating on the road we have a partial road closure here because the water is coming down fierce right now and i'm sure the folks i spoke to earlier and Silver Spring, who had those flooded out vehicles, are a bit worried that Mother Nature just won't let up. Take a listen. We pulled over because we literally saw you and your dad yeah. pushing your car out. Mm -hmm. So uh, this is your baby. What happened? It's my baby. Uh, it might be totaled, actually. Uh, um, hopefully it's not, but it might be. So basically, like, it was, it was just really flooded. We had cars parked here. You know, my mom, she was here by herself. And we, we weren't here, so she tried moving them all, you know, and like, unfortunately, she didn't get to my car on time. And she got the other cars yeah. up the hill. Yeah, she got the other cars up the hill, but my baby, though. <laughs> she so she tried the starting the car and moving it, and what happened? Yeah, yeah, she tried starting the car and moving it, but then it turned off because, like, there was just so much water. So, yeah, and now we, we, we don't want to turn it on now to, like, damage it even more, you know. But So keeping your fingers crossed, I yeah, guess? Yeah, keeping my fingers crossed. Hope for the best, you know. I remember the big storm Isabel we had, all that rain. It never got that bad even when we had all that rain here. I don't know what happened. Either the sewers are backed up, but I know Dewey Park, they got something going on with the park now. It's supposed to be sewer or something because it smelled bad down there on Dewey Road. Uh -huh. So maybe the drains might be clogged. I don't know. But I ain't never seen it that bad. He said he lived in that neighborhood off Randolph Road and Dewey Roads and Silver Spring and had never seen it that bad. And take a look here at Sligo Creek Parkway. It is looking pretty bad. The Sligo Creek clearly is right behind us and is contributing uh, to maybe some of this low lying area that is going to be, uh, we fear, maybe full of water. And so, of course, uh, the road closure will remain in effect. We saw some cars kind of sneaking through the cones. And of course, a recommendation and a warning for those drivers, don't even attempt. If you know this is a low-lying area, if you are aware of low-lying areas in your community, best bet is to stay away. And of course, we've always heard to keep those drains clear so the water, hopefully, will subside. Back to you in the studio.